Um, my grandparents uh, lived in Ukraine, and uh, in the twenties, when things got very rough there with the revolution and the bandits, and the system was just falling apart. Uh, my grandmother and her son, who's my dad, and she's also pregnant. She immigrated with her her mother and siblings. Her husband could not come. He was in the White Army, the wrong side, so he could not come. So she very unwillingly came with her family, and they moved to Vineland, and they moved there in 1925, 26, sorry, 26. My dad was a year old, my grandmother was pregnant, no husband. And that's how they came here. Uh, they lived in Vineland with, with her siblings and her mom, and uh, they helped with farming in that area. In 1930, my grandfather was able to, I, I believe, literally escape out of the Ukraine, and he joined his wife in 1930. And uh, they lived in the Vineland for several years until 1934, and then they uh, bought one of the first farms in a Niven Road, that was a Mennonite farm, one of the first Mennonite settlers in Niagara on the Lake in 1934 on Niven Road. The farmhouse is still there, it's still being farmed there, and some of my uh, cousins still live in the, on this original farm yet. Uh, so my dad grew up on the farm as well, along with, uh, there were 12 in the family. So they had a 10-acre farm on Divin Road, and they, they managed to make a living at that. Nowadays it seems quite incredible, but they did in those days. Uh, my dad also worked at the canning factory at the corner of um, Lakeshore and, and uh, Creek Road. Walls Canning Factory, and that, the man who came also from the Ukraine and set up, he had some money apparently, and set up a canning factory, and all the men worked there. They canned peaches, tomatoes, pears, the whole lot. Mm -hmm. And so everybody that moved here from, uh, from the Ukraine, the, all the men they all worked there virtually. That's where my mom and dad actually met, <laughs> and uh, they got married in 1945, in November. My dad was a truck driver at the time for the canning factory. And my mom worked at the canning factory as well. 